Hi friends, I'm Vivek Rajgopalan. I had done a looping video uh, some time back and uh, it's been a long time since I continue to do more such um, videos on looping. So here's one uh, I thought I'll do where you can actually do freestyle looping. Um, what I'll do first is I'll just show you how I actually have a preset beat and then play on top of it um, and then loop my mridangam. So, uh, which is like what you can do normally. And then I'll show you what freestyle looping is. So if I can just show you the setting here. I've put it to two bars. Start song and set and follow song tempo. And if I can just move up. Yeah, so there I've just put a very basic beat here. I'm going to set this to, so that's 120 BPM. Yeah, I'll just play and show you what happens now. So here I've just put like a beat and then quickly put a, a loop on top of it. Yeah. Right. So now what I'll do is I'll show you what freestyle looping is, which is it's the same beat that is there on my clip. Um, but I'll play completely free first. I'll loop first and then see what the beat does. So in this case, I'm going to change the setting a bit. I'd like you to uh, show them. So now I'm going to make it to X bars, which is like a variable length. Just clear the earlier loop. Right. And now that this is set, I'll show you what happens. I'm going to change the tempo a bit and let's see what happens. That's option one. As you can see, the beat has gone almost double now, yeah? Now, I'm going to play a longer loop and then see, just hear what happened to the beat. So as you can see, I just took a, like a longer loop and the minute I did that, the beat sample that I had earlier has almost become half. Right, now I'm going to try different patterns. I'll play 3-4, I'll play a 5-4 and see what happens. Here we go. Yeah, next one, even smaller. Yeah, now I'll try a 5-4. Right, so that's how you can actually have fun with the same sample or the loop that you have. Obviously, I mean, I'm a Mridangam player, so I use my own techniques to to kind of map uh, Ableton. Uh, if you're a guitar player, bass player, and you want to do the same, uh, the rules of the game are the same. It's just that I find looping first and then 
locking onto the beat um, more fun because it just uh, leaves a lot of room for intuition. Yeah, so I hope you like the video. Uh, please do share and leave your comments. Uh, it's really encouraging for people like me and I'll continue to put small tricks on on my page. Thank you.